John, we're here at the Geneva Space on the Open Connectivity Foundation booth. Geneva Alliance has made a couple of important announcements here at uh, CES 2017. I believe you're going to talk to us about one of those. Yes, we uh, announced as the Geneva Alliance uh, that we're going to be having a uh, one-year pilot program with, uh, the, the, with Nevada's uh, transportation, uh, specifically here in the, in the city of Las Vegas, uh, really uh, doing some exciting things with our remote vehicle interaction technology, RVI. Right. And we will be having, using uh, hundreds of city vehicles uh, and the city infrastructure to really test the ways that cars can talk to the infrastructure, the signals, the, uh, uh, the, the data that's in their data center that, that's collected about when things are moving around and, and uh, when a when, a, uh, when there's a traffic congestion and when, there is, uh, uh, when there's a particularly uh, heavy pedestrian zone, for example, and get that information not only back to the car, but also back to the data center that the, that the uh, government has so that they can then do better planning. Gunnar, I've already spoken to your Geneva colleague, John. Yes. That's one of the two major themes for Geneva at CES 2017, and that was the Smart City project. Right, uh, yes. You're going to talk to me about Smart Home, I believe. Yes, we've done a, a demonstration here with, uh, together with the Open Connectivity Foundation. And uh, that's uh, just an example for Geneva, how we work with other organizations that also work on open standards and, and, and open source. We are, what we are trying to demonstrate here is a smart home with a connected vehicle which adapts itself to the preferences of the user who is actually using it. So let's say you are at home and you are trying to uh, run through a typical day, trying to get to office. And as you leave your home, the sensors in your home are going to detect that you are leaving the house and the vehicle is going to get ready for you to set its preferred temperature, your preferred uh, driving positions and your preferred uh, mirror positions and other parameters of the car which you normally do on a daily basis. Imagine a user who is leaving home and uh, head, headed for office. As I leave my home, all I have to do is simply walk out of the door and the vehicle already knows that through the sensors in, inside my home and is going to set the setting, user settings of the vehicle according to my user preference. In this case, let's say I'm triggering a going out of home scenario. As you can see, the vehicle is adapting itself, setting the mirror positions lowering the windows and unfolding the roof according to my user preference settings. Once this is done, I'm already set for a comfortable ride ahead. In fact, in future, we are imagining situations where the navigation system will also be ready for you to actually take you to the place where you want to go, depending on your calendar settings. So these things are coming in the future. Because Genevi is a full-blown devel automotive development platform, it enables us to build software solutions on top of it which enables us to create innovative applications that benefit the users. One example of that is because there is a full-blown Linux system running on top of this vehicle, we can actually run a rule, rule engine and a gateway on the Geneva development platform, which knows when the user leaves, who else is there in the home, and accordingly set the temperature of this thermostat. This is, these devices are all connected via the Open Connectivity Foundation standards, and because they all speak the same la common language, they can talk to each other easily. In this particular scenario, the user just left home, and the rest of the family is still at home. So the Lyric thermostat has adjusted itself to, be, to make it comfortable enough for the other people in the home to have a comfortable temperature. One another important use case we are demonstrating as part of this activity is as you have multiple devices in your home, you have multiple smart devices which can all talk to each other. We can enable a lot of uh, notification-based use cases as well. Let's imagine you are leaving home for a long drive and you forgot to uh, close the door of your refrigerator. You can actually see that on the smartwatch, just, in, just at the time of leaving, as I open my door, if the fridge door is open, I get a notification on my wearable device that my fridge is open, so I can take immediate action just in time, at a time exactly when I need to know, know about the event. At the end of the day, when the user comes back home, 
He doesn't have to remember to lock his door, raise his windows. All these things can be automatically programmed into the Genevi development platform. And this can be signaled from OCF, OCF-enabled wearable device to the Genevi vehicle, which also understands OCF. So as you can see, the vehicle understood that I reached my home and it is automatically locking itself, it's closing the roof and it's raising the windows. And if you observe over here, the thermostat has changed its value from my previous setting to a current setting that is comfortable enough for me. Because to me, we really sets out only to, to support the industry, to be more effective. And everything, all the software we do is open source. Anybody can adopt it and we're open to talk to, to, to everybody.